my channel and welcome to today's video. So last week I was out and about and I ran into this beautiful lady. She was like a, such an amazing older lady. So she tapped me on the back and she said to me, um, are you Chichi Beauty? And I looked around and I said yes. And she said, can you come over here a little bit? Come over here a little bit. And I was like, you know, I'm really not used to people like coming up to me like that. Sometimes people look, they stare, and later on they might just say something. But this lady was like so on me, like, come over here a little bit. So she took me aside and she said, I so love your channel. I've been using everything that you post. Look at my skin. My skin is amazing. But guess what? I like when you make those serums and lotion for the skin. When you mix up all that oils and you know, you put it in the blender and you blend it, I get excited and I just run in my kitchen and I this lady was just going on. Now, after listening to her talking, guys, I got like a little emotional. I was like just beyond myself, feeling happy, feeling excited, just knowing that there are people like you out there who are actually using my remedies and are actually getting really amazing and awesome results. People like you who just can't wait for the next video to post so that you could whip up something in the comfort of your Oh, today I'm making a rice serum for you guys. I am making an anti-aging facial serum just for you, my love, and for all my subscribers and for all my new subscribers and for anyone that is watching that want to try something amazing, something new, guess what? This anti-aging facial is for you, loaded with anti-aging properties such as vitamin A and vitamin C. Also, this contains B vitamins, fatty acid that's gonna help to plump that skin up and boots that collagen production in the skin so if you're interested in the video guys let's go in the kitchen and just whip this up oh. now to make this face serum you're gonna need a blender you're gonna need a bowl to mix your stuff in and you're gonna need a storage container i like to use a wide mouth for this however you can use any form of a bottle with a tight cover now here is the first ingredient and here i have some rice now this is a cooked rice what i did with this rice i cooked it for about 10 minutes strain it off and then I put it aside to cool and here I have the cooked rice. Now the reason for doing that is not to overcook the rice to protect the natural nutrients, the natural vitamins and minerals that is in the rice. Now today I'm using white rice, however, if you have other rice like black rice or purple rice, go ahead and use it. So what I'm going to do with the rice to begin, I'm going to be blending the rice. I'm going to take my blender, I'm going to use a quarter cup of rice, which is 60 ml of rice, pour that in and I'm going to introduce the next ingredient. Here I have some rose water. Listen carefully guys. I am going to use the rose water to blend the rice. However, if you do not have rose water, go ahead and brew some green tea and use that water to blend the rice. Rose water has anti-inflammatory properties that can help reduce the redness of irritated skin. It can help to get rid of acne and eczema. It is great for cleansing the skin and it helps to remove dirt and grease from the skin and it also have to hydrate the skin so i am going to be using one tablespoon of the rose water in this recipe which is 15 ml and i'm pouring that in the rice now guys here i have another ingredient that i'm going to place in the blender along with the rice and this is honey Honey is full of antioxidant and it is great for slowing down aging. It helps to boost complexion and it is extremely moisturizing and smoothing. So it also helps to create a glow to the skin. So I'm using half of a teaspoon of the honey and I'm pouring that in. And now I'm gonna cover. Now take a look at what I have here. Here I have the blended rice and this is what it looks like but we're not done yet guys we are gonna move on since we are gonna be making everything in 
the blender. We just give the rice and the rose water a push start. So now here in the blender we have the quarter cup of rice, one tablespoon rose water and a teaspoon of honey and now we are gonna move on. Now we're gonna use one teaspoon which is 5 ml of these oils. Now the first oil that I'm gonna use is some ooba oil. Ooba oil contains anti-aging properties that will help to boost the collagen production in the skin. It will also help to moisturize and hydrate the skin. I am using one teaspoon of the ooba oil. Now please note that all these oils that I'm using, you do not have to use all. Use the oils you have at home. Just use your favorite oil in this recipe. So I'm pouring one teaspoon of the ooba oil. And the next oil is one of my favorite oil and this is a rosehip oil loaded with vitamin A which help to plump the skin up and also boost the collagen production. A wonderful oil to moisturize the skin. And I'm going to be using one teaspoon 5 ml of the rosehip oil and the rosehip oil have a very nice color that I like to see. Pour this in. Now take a look here guys, I have two special oils. I have some aloe vera oil. Now if you do not have aloe vera oil, you can use a fresh aloe vera in this recipe. And aloe vera is great for clearing dark spots and blemishes from the skin. Using the same amount, one teaspoon. And this have a little shaker going, so I just have to keep shaking it in the spoon. And this have a nice green color to it. First press aloe vera oil. And we're pouring this in. Moving on to the next ingredient, which is the sesame seed oil. Another wonderful oil loaded with vitamin A that will fight the aging process. And as I said, you do not have to use all these oils. Now when it comes on to the sesame seed oil, you got to look for the unroasted sesame seed oil. Unroasted sesame seed oil do not have any strong smell. Do not use the one for stir fry, okay? Use the first press unroasted sesame seed oil and take a look at the color of the sesame seed oil totally different from the roasted one so we're gonna pour that in and we're moving on now guys everyone need to use a little vitamin E oil in this recipe and I have a dropper this is 28,000 IU so I'm gonna put about uh, three to four drops about a half of a teaspoon of vitamin E oil. Just use your discretion with the vitamin E oil. Now please take a look at what I have here. I have two essential oil. I have lemon essential oil and I have tea tree essential oil. Now if you have acne prone skin, if you have a lot of pimples on your skin, you're going to use the tea tree oil in this recipe. Now for everyone else, you can use the lemon essential oil loaded with vitamin C. Now these two are also optional okay so I'm gonna have about four to five drops of the lemon essential oil not a lot and then I'm gonna add my final oil to this guys and the final oil is vitamin A oil and I'm using vitamin A capsule now vitamin A oil is very strong and it do need a carrier oil a little goes a long way so for this recipe I'm only using two capsule and these are 2400 mcg all right so to get the oils which is going to be about six drops I'll just will have to pierce the capsule so I'm just gonna pinch and squeeze as I said about six drops I'm gonna get one two three four five I get about five drops from this one which is very good and I'm reaching for the next one and I'm gonna pinch it also all right perfect and let's see how much drops I'm getting two three four same amount five drops so that's about 10 drops depending on your IU of vitamin A oil. Now, if you don't have the vitamin A oil, guys, not to worry, it's not a deal breaker. Since the rest of the oils have 
amazing anti-aging properties also all right guys so I'm moving on to the only carrier oil that I'm gonna be using in this and this is some grapeseed oil you can choose to use some olive oil some coconut oil or even some sweet almond oil and for the carrier oil I'm using two teaspoons of the carrier oil so that is one and that is two teaspoons of my carrier oil and that is it for the oils in this recipe and what I'm gonna do next I'm gonna cover oh I forget one ingredient that I want to use and this is another optional ingredient which is some vegetable glycerin hydrate into the skin but I'm using it also as a preservative and I'm gonna use one teaspoon of the vegetable glycerin and pour this in so now we are gonna cover and take a look at this guys here it is and let's pour this in our container there is our serum let's get everything out take a look at this this is our anti-aging collagen boosting wrinkle fighting dark spot remover facial cream this is best used at night if you want to be really generous with it however it is also great for the daytime a little goes a long way so i'm going to go on the other side and i'm going to show you how to use this for best result So to use this guys you just want to wash your skin thoroughly it's best to exfoliate your skin if you have not done that for a long time and then pat dry the skin apply your favorite facial toner and then you're going to use the facial cream on your skin now this do contain a little bit of water from the cooked rice so I suggest that you keep it in the refrigerator for no more than seven to ten days okay now you're just gonna take a little bit a little bit goes a long way and this is way too much and you are gonna just massage it on the skin in circular motion you're just gonna pat it on the skin so just pat it on the skin don't be alarmed when you just start to massage it just continue to massage it and what you're going to notice it just going to seep right in the skin now what i like about this uh, facial cream is that it has a the tightening effect from the starch from the rice so when you use it at night on your face when you wake up in the morning it's gonna feel like it just grab your face and tighten your face however it's not gonna feel dry at all but very moisturizing for best and now this can be used every night guys this is an unlimited facial cream that you can use for younger looking skin so apply at night wake up in the morning with tight firm younger fresher radiant glowing skin 